Hello friends, welcome to School Server uh, tutorial. In this uh, sub series, we are going to learn about table compression. And in this uh, very first video, we will get introduced to table compression. So, as the name suggests, it's a compression and table compression helps in saving disk storage. So we know about compressing the file. A zip compression will reduce the file size. The same way table compression will reduce size of the table. The disk cost is high, especially for database, as people prefer high performing hardware. So they usually perform disk with high speed I.O. I mean input output disk operation. So that's why the disk cost in production database is high. Usually, people spend more cost on high performing disk. So, saving disk storage is a must for live DB or we can call it as a production DB. So, when you compress data in the production, they no need to buy more disk. So, a table can grow very fast in a production system. Say for example, if you compare Google merchandise website or Amazon online retail shop, the DB will grow within a day. So in that case, compressing the table that involves users transaction, purchase, sales of, I mean the sales. So compressing the table will benefit and they will I mean the disk compression will save a disk cost in that case since indexes are stored in physical storage we can also compress indexes just like table you can compress indexes as well Compressing non-clustered index is efficient. So compressing the data help in improving the disk I.O. response time as well. So when there is a client application that is accessing the SQL Server database, and to fulfill the request, SQL Server will read and write content into the table. And this read-write operation is performed on the disk because that's where the data files, that's where the data file gets saved, right? So, compressing the data help in improving disk I/O. Suppose if a specific operation requires transferring the data of 5 GB or let's state 5 KB for one single operation and if data compression I mean the table compression is applied it may get reduced to 3 or 4 KB so here for one single operation we will be saving one kilobyte of data so since transfer is reduced the disk IO response time will be more so here we can call it as a response time when all 5 KB is transferred for the query or for the data fetch then we can call operation is completed here if you see if only 4 KB is transferred we can still state the operation is completed so this way we can say disk IO response time is less when we perform table compression The below table shows data types that yields good compression ratio. 
here you can see integer big int decimal numeric real money date time and care data type so these are all the data types in a table that will give good compression ratio so let's state that we have a table and the table contains three columns c1 c2 and c3 and let's state that the data types are first one the data type is real data type second one is big int and the third one is care so if this is the case and let's assume that there are 4 billion record in this table so once you perform compression and if size 4 billion record and let's state that the byte record to store this is 4 GB and because of compression if you saved it as 3 GB you can see the picture here so here we saved 1 GB of disk cost so that's how the table compression is benefited here we are talking about only one table and if there are many other table with a huge number of data doing compression you can save a huge amount of data so if we take amazon just for example if we take uh, uh, heavy duty websites like amazon or google merchandise the data can grow 4 gb just in one day because of millions of transaction or in one week of time and if you are saving 1 gb in one week time frame and you can convert that in one month and you can convert that in multiple regions say for example google merchandise for uh, australia google merchandise for europe africa so likewise if you split that region wise and the save in uh, disk space will be very high and that saves some of that will save some money also that's all here in this video thank you for watching bye